one of the most popular and beloved anime characters, Roronoa Zoro is widely considered to be the closest thing One Piece has to a deuteragonist. The series mainly revolves around Luffy. However, if there is one character whose importance comes even relatively close to that of the former, that's Zoro, who has been there with him since the very beginning as his loyal right-hand man. In the franchise's popularity polls, Zoro consistently receives the second highest number of votes, cementing his status as the second main protagonist. This video will take a look at seven anime characters who share Zoro's archetype as formidable fighters who eventually befriend the main hero. The first character sitting at the top of this list is Vegeta. The secondary protagonist of Akira Toriyama's Dragon Ball series, Vegeta, is probably the deuteragonist and anti-hero par excellence among all anime characters. Throughout the series, Vegeta transitions from a murderous killer to a righteous defender of the earth, all while remaining the prideful prince of Saiyans. Just like Zoro, Vegeta trains incredibly hard. Zoro strives to become stronger in order to fulfill his personal ambitions, protect his comrades, and assist Luffy in the search for the One Piece. As for Vegeta, he endeavors to shield his beloved family and surpass his long-standing rival Goku. Zoro and Vegeta are natural-born warriors who live for the thrill of battle and won't hesitate to kill their opponents if they have to. Just as Vegeta is the only one who can truly keep up with Goku's growth, Zoro is the only one among all the Straw Hats and the 11 Supernovas who can use the same advanced conqueror's hockey as Luffy. Selfless and brave, both Vegeta and Zoro are capable of putting their own lives on the line without hesitation. The next one is Sasuke Uchiha, the deuteragonist of Masashi Kishimoto's Naruto. Sasuke spent most of his life searching for power and seeking revenge until he eventually reconciled with his best friend and greatest rival, Naruto Uzumaki. Just like Zoro, Sasuke is a highly proficient swordsman. Sasuke typically channels the Chidori's lightning-style chakra through his blade to increase its sharpness and lethality. Zoro, on the other hand, can imbue his three swords with armament hockey and even conqueror's hockey significantly increasing their power output. Sasuke can manifest Susano, a humanoid-shaped chakra avatar that acts as an extension of his will. This technique bears some resemblance to Zoro's nine-sword-style Ashura, which triples the latter's power by seemingly multiplying his body with its three-headed and six-armed silhouette. Zoro's Asura appears to be a Susano made up of Haki, the next one is Killua Zoldic, the heir of the fearsome Zoldic family. Killua plays a pivotal role in Hunter x Hunter as the franchise's deuteragonist. Ruthless, violent, and bloodthirsty Killua is the complete opposite of his best friend Gon. Gon's innocence and purity softened Killua's behavior, calming his bloodlust, which he maintained only towards anyone who threatened his life or Gon's. Killua's sincere attachment to Gon is very similar to Zoro's close relationship with Luffy. Just like Killua won't let any foe approach Gon. Zoro is always at Luffy's side, ready to protect and assist him as his trusted right-hand man. In return for Zoro's unwavering devotion, Luffy has complete faith in the green-haired swordsman's capabilities. Zoro's presence is a magnet for fans, and so is Kalua's. Both are typically involved in breathtaking scenes that emphasize their formidable combat skills and steadfast resolve, establishing them as two of the coolest anime characters. Now, the next one is Kenpachi Zaraki from Bleach. There are few anime characters who share as many tropes as Kenpachi and Zoro. First and foremost, both of them are outstanding swordsmen. They typically overwhelm their opponents with tremendous slashes, which pack enough power to destroy mountains with ease. In addition to their insane power, Zoro and Kenpachi also stand out for their toughness, as they can endure grievous injuries and still keep fighting ferociously. To avoid killing his enemies too soon, Zaraki wears a special eye patch. This item suppresses his spiritual pressure, allowing him to prolong his battles and enjoy them to the fullest. Likewise, Zoro has a headband that he only wears when he decides to start fighting seriously. United by the same passion for combat, these two swordsmen would probably enjoy each other's company. Funnily enough, Zoro and Kenpachi also share the same lack of sense of direction. Despite being extremely sharp in battle, they are hilariously unable to find their way around to complete ordinary tasks. To be fair, Kenpachi often gets lost due to following Yachiru's bad directions, while Zoro does everything by himself and can literally get lost on a straight path. An absurd feat, even for anime characters. The next one is Genos from One Punch Man. Within the narrative universe of One Punch Man, Genos is a cyborg who fights for justice. Genos has a very serious demeanor, as his sole goal is to become stronger. His commitment and resolve are absolute, much like Roronoa Zoro's. Genos is nicknamed Demon Cyborg, a moniker that recalls Zoro's recurring demonic 
demonic imagery. Due to his outstanding might and menacing aura, Zoro is often likened to a demon in human form. While Genos and Zoro follow very different pathways, both manage to put their demonic side at the service of their comrades, which makes them two inspirational anime characters. Now, the next one is Inosuke Hashibaira from Demon Slayer. Inosuke is a talented swordsman, as well as one of the greatest companions of the protagonist Tanjiro Kamado. Inosuke is a ferocious fighter who remains courageous in front of any enemy. These traits make him similar to Roronoa Zoro, who possesses the very same unwavering spirit. Zoro typically wields three katanas, while Inosuke's fighting style revolves around the dual wielding of two Nikurin swords. These special blades can change color, according to the owner's prowess, much like the black blades that Zoro is set to achieve in One Piece. And the last one is Urza Scarlet from Fairy Tail. Urza is strong, relentless, and determined, just like Zoro. What's more, both of these two anime characters are formidable swordsmen. Zoro relies on a combination of physical prowess, advanced forms of hacky, and unorthodox techniques, while Urza amps her swordsmanship through the usage of magic. Despite their stern appearances as deadly swordsmen, Zoro and Urza share the same comical fondness for alcohol. Zoro typically carries around bottles of alcohol and loathes being deprived of it. As for for Urza, she loves to drink, but funnily enough, can't handle the liquor. So these are some characters who resemble Zoro. Now, there are many other characters as well, but we'll talk about them in another video. But if you enjoyed the videos, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. We'll meet again with another amazing video. Until then, goodbye.